In order to write an essay, you must have a language in which to write it. You could write an essay in English or Japanese or Spanish or Mandarin, but there must be a language. The same is true for programming. You must have a language in which to write. Just as different written languages have different syntaxes, different vocabularies, different structures, so also different programming languages have different syntax, different vocabulary, and different structures. There are dozens, even hundreds of programming languages out there with many similarities and many differences. There are a lot of ways to categorize programming languages. For example, static languages require a compilation step, while dynamic languages don't. High-level languages involve a great deal of abstraction away from the low-level details of the computer like memory, whereas low-level languages require programmers to do a lot more of those things manually. So why do so many languages exist? Well, different languages are good for different things. When you're optimizing very highly for performance, as you might for a complex video game or a complicated mathematical function, you might want to have more control over the little details of how things are run. If you're more interested in being able to design rapidly, you might be more interested in a language that doesn't force you to think about all those details.